We're just entering the castle. What is this thing? Hmm. Okay. Well, I could save here. There's three entrances. There's three different... Oh my god! That's what that is. It's a trampoline. Okay. Make that... Five entrances? <laughs> what the heck? There's so many ways to go. Let's go this way first. Oh, I think that's just a window, actually. I thought it was a door. Uh, okay, well, let's go this way. Ooh, look at this place. Hooktail Castle. Okay. Oh man, Hooktail Castle. The story's well true. This place is terrifying. Alright, let's go back in. I got a little cutscene of Hooktail Castle. I, I'm kind of curious about what's above, though. That's just a window. But, like, what's over here? There's two different exits. Oh, I could fly? Oh. Okay. <laughs> okay. Well, I was supposed to make it to the top area, but I didn't do it. Okay. I kind of forgot how to fly again, by the way. What's this guy? Is this a dry bones? Looks weird. Got him. Alright, so that was a flying Koopa Paratroopa. Um... So therefore, he has, like, defense 2, I believe. So, he's different than these normal Koopas. Dang it! I missed. I missed the mark. Oh, he just used the item. Defense is boosted. Okay. That's fine. Dang it! I missed it again. That's really hard to do, actually. That's actually pretty difficult to do. I've been getting lucky the first times. Got it. Okay. Let me jump on this other one so that he flips over onto his back. Got it. Let me use this special move. Just cause Mario's getting low on HP, I might as well. Oh yeah, I totally forgot. I totally forgot how to use this. <laughs> nice. Well, I didn't even heal that much. But I guess I'm almost at full HP, so I guess it's fine. I just wanted to make sure I used that gauge move so that I could start filling it up again. Right? I feel like whenever I have it, it's probably a good idea to just use it instantly anyways. Just because, you know, it's there. Might as well use it. I think all of these are dry bones, but they look different. <gasps> oh god! He was fast! He was so fast. Yeah. 
Ow. What does Power Shell do? Ram Koopa Shell through all enemies on the ground while he hides inside it. Okay. Nice. That was pretty good. Very, very cool. And that's a level up. Perfect. Alright, so we did HP, FP, and then now we have to do uh, BP, right? That makes sense. That makes sense. We, we did all of them now. We leveled up three times. Oh, and it completely filled up my gauge. Awesome. I could just use it again. Ooh, power bounce. Jump on foes multiple times. Don't I already have that one? Oh, no, I don't. Okay. So, I could use this one again for some reason. I don't know what good that will do. If you guys know, then let me know in the comments below. But, like, I already have close call. So, I don't know what good that would do. Oh, it looks like I could also only equip four badges, I guess. Right? Maybe it depends on like how much BP I have. Um. Oh, so I see. This one, it has a three next to it. So does that mean how much BP I have? When I unequip it, I get the three back. So I could only have up to six BP. So however many BP I have is however many badges I could equip because these three all cost one so that makes the three plus the three for the power bounce makes the six and I have the remaining BP zero out of six okay I'm understanding things I'm understanding things all right jump on one foe multiple times with properly Executed action commands. Let's do this one. Let's get all the wings off. <laughs> there you go. Alright, and then this one. Got it. Guard. Guard. Okay. As for you, you could go and defeat this one. Nice. Okay. I gotta jump on this one again. Because it got back up for some reason. I don't know how, but it got back up. Alright, let me go ahead and use the multi-bounce again. Then you could attack this guy. Dang it! <laughs> I missed it again. Okay. That is fantastic. I hate missing it. That's fine, I didn't really care about that one. Got star points. Awesome. Very, very awesome. Okay. There's a mushroom on the ground. You got a mushroom. Cool. Can't carry any more items. Use a toss something. Um, I guess I could use one, honestly, because I have a lot. So I could just use it on oh and I can also heal people in my party cool I'll just use it on Mario um so there's a door over here but before I also did see a 
I also saw a um, a staircase. So what's up here? Oh, this is where the plane lands. Oh, so then I could just fly back if I need to. Okay. I see. Okay, so if I want to go back, I could just fly back. No big deal. Alright, let's keep going. Oh, oh no! These bones, they remind me of my father. There's no doubt about it. It's my father! Dad! Um, wait, what's this? My father's clutching some kind of letter, or at least his... Ugh, bones are. So, what should I do? Should I read it? Yeah, obviously, right? <laughs> Definitely. Um, okay, I could do this. I I'll read it. Ahem. I came to this castle to destroy Hooktail, but I am stuck and can go no further. So in this letter, I shall note Hooktail's weaknesses for those who follow. The dread Hooktail cannot to tolerate croaking creatures that begin with F and end with ROG. I heard that something related to Hooktail's weakness is hidden somewhere in this castle. If one is to have any hope of defeating Hooktail, one must first find whatever that thing is. One last thing, if faced with ultimate doom, the fiend will surely use any trick to save herself. Alas, I do not have the strength to continue writing. Already, mist veils my eyes. My last words go to my son, Colorado. I love you, and I'm proud of who you've become. Huh? My son, Colorado, not Coops? <laughs> Oops. Um, yeah, I guess this isn't my father after all. But if this isn't my father, I wonder if that pile of bones over there is my dad. This one? Or this one? Which one are you talking about? This one? I think it's a pink one. This one? Blarf, harf, harf. You clearly don't value your lives much if you come to this castle to disturb us. You will go no further, and from this moment on, you'll be nothing but bones. Wow. Ouch, what are they doing? It's no use all over me. Man, what should we do? Yeah. Hammer your way through them. Oh my god, this is so satisfying to sing them all fly. I got it. Oh my god, we have an audience of bones. Can't flee this fight. Um, can I switch my party member? Or my party? Is that possible? Can I like switch who's in my party? Swap partner. Nice. Um, I want Goombella to... Tell me about these guys. Dull dry bones and red bones. Let's do red bones. That's a red bones. A little too red, I think. No fast and chance, you know? Max is speech 5, attack is 3, and defense is 1. Unlike your average dull bones, even if you pound it to 0 HP and it crumbles, it totally might revive like a zombie. My advice is to get rid of all the dull bones and attack the red bones. Oh, and one more thing. Once its trends start to fall, it may create some more. Okay. Uh, well, we'll see. We'll see about that. Okay. I guarded all of those. Um, alright. So, let's see here. I have a feeling dry bones are like resistant to fire just cuz I think that's been in a previous Mario game where they're like fire doesn't damage them. Oh, that doesn't damage them either. Um what about these dull bones? What can you tell me about them? So jump doesn't hurt them. Does hammer? 
That's a dull bone, sort of a skeleton thing. It was a Koopa Troopa once. Max HP is 1, attack is 2, and defense is 1. These creeps throw bones to attack. Oh, and they build reinforcements too. Attacks that can strike multiple dough bones at once are the most effective. Okay, but jump doesn't work. So what can I use? What can I use if jump doesn't work? I need to be able to attack multiple at once. Okay. Can I swap partner? I think Koops might be able to help. Power shell. I feel like that's gotta work. I just have a gut feeling. Boom! That worked. Okay, cool. That's a trick. You gotta use a Koopa to defeat a Koopa. <laughs> that's how it goes. Um, okay, and then as for you, can I hammer you, maybe? Okay, I failed to get the mark, but that's fine. Okay, as for you, let me try a shell. Okay, that worked. You're building reinforcements. So the hammer does work, I probably just have to use the power one. Boom. Okay. I'm gonna try the normal. Okay, that did work. Cool. So for the dry bones, jump just doesn't work. And I'm assuming fire doesn't either, because that's been like a dry bones thing for like forever, that fire doesn't hurt them. Um, so I'm assuming fire doesn't hurt them, so hammers is the way to go. Or a turtle shell. Um, okay. What's up with these dry bones? Oh god! You are fast! So some of them will just eventually come to life, apparently. Oh my god, I want those items. Can I swap? I'm just like, oh my god, I want those items. Give them to me. Give me those items. I want them. Nah, you did not give me those items. How dare you. <gasps> Ooh, I got a shine sprite. A mysterious powerful object. Collecting these will help. Ooh. Dang it, I thought I was going to jump on you, but I guess it didn't. Well, I guess also jumping doesn't work, so it doesn't even matter. Alright, well... Dang it! I missed. I probably have to get it perfect too if I wanted to even do damage. That might be why the shell isn't working. Because I probably actually have to get it perfect if I wanted to do damage. 
All right, let's try again. Yeah, okay, that does seem to be the case. You have to get your moves perfect if you want them to cause damage. Cool. All right. Let's see what we can do. Um, what is down here? Okay, that's like an elevator of some sort. This one moves what? It can't move anything because the thing is in the way. How do I... go here I could go up okay so that's locked I think I know what to do I think I could probably go like this god it's hard to jump dang it I need to keep him there but like it's hard to jump if um If I'm also trying to hold this guy in place. Let me see. There you go, I'm trying. I'm trying. And then if I go this way, I could jump. Jump. There we go. Boom. That's what I wanted, right? Okay, what's over here? Oh, a star piece, okay. I guess that was what I wanted. It wasn't exactly what I wanted, but I guess it works. I'm glad I figured out how to do that. Okay, and then we go this way. Oh, I could just break that. Okay, so then I want to hit the yellow button. So let's do the same exact thing. Nope, uh, let's do it this way gonna hold him in place and then the way I'm doing this you guys is literally I'm using like both fingers on top of what's it called oh god well that's going up oh wait since it's out of the way maybe I could do this oh Oh! <laughs> That's way easier. Um, okay. <laughs> I guess we'll do that. I was gonna say, I'm doing like both fingers on the the A, B, X, Y buttons. Castle key red. A key that opens a door in Hooked Castle. Alright. I do want to get on top of this yellow button though, if I can. Because I feel like that's important because the purple one was pretty important to get a star piece so maybe the yellow one will also be important so I feel like if I hit this one and then I hit this one and then if I go up and then I jump down no if I if I do this okay I think this is it and then I go this way, this way, this way, this way, this way, this way. We jump up here. We jump up here. Oh god, this is so hard to do. We jump over here. Oh god, nope, that wasn't it. Okay. I get on here. Oh, hey, okay, cool. Um, that's definitely what I wanted. A lovely piece of a star. Cool. Okay, and then I don't know what else is over there. Okay, so let's go. Let's just go back. I'm so glad I actually ended up doing that. That was so good. 
Here you go. Hookto Castle Grand Staircase. Alright, so there's a save slot here. I better... I better save it. Okay. These dry bones are not going to come alive, right? Hopefully not. Alright, so there's a green thing over here. Okay. We're going up. I don't know where we're going, but we're going up. There's a green lock that I need to figure out. Oh, and then there's like a button over here or a badge. How do I get to it though? It looks like he can't get to it because it's a bit too high. Okay. How do I get this thing back down? Oh, I guess I just fall. Okay, so I could keep going to the side if I need to. Let me get that back down. I could keep going this way. Dang it! <laughs> I tried to hit him. Didn't work. Okay, Mario is really close to dying. So I'm gonna try this. Oh, he can't attack, huh? Maybe I could, like, swap partner? There we go. Ow. Okay. Yeah, he's about to die, so I should probably use a mushroom. Sadly, the mushrooms really do not heal, like, anything at all. Alright, let's go ahead and use the gauge move. To heal us some more. Alright, so I found out the reason like I freeze at times is because I get like a, a bad mushroom from this uh, minigame. I get like a bad mushroom and then it makes me freeze. So, that's not fun, but I mean, I can't really avoid them, honestly. Since I just go willy-nilly with everything. Alright, that was really 